Hello, Dr. L here. This is a quick video to show you how to plot moon tides inside of Ninja Trader. To start with, you must have a, a uh, subscription to the day trading forecast site, uh, which displays its own charts with Ninja Trade uh, with moon tides on them, and you must have purchased the uh, data file component that we have produced for NinjaTrader. Uh, you order both of these products at moneytide.com and uh, I'm not going to go through the whole order process. Uh, you start placing an order on the place an order link and there you log in and after that you can go to the catalog order form. And I'll just point out on the order form the two things that you need to order. First of all, uh, tomorrow's market hotline email, uh, less than $100 a month. That gets you the moon tides and will get you a login for the daytradingforecast.com website. And you also need this Ninja Trader component, the EFT, that stands for Energy Field Trading, uh, data file. Uh, $36 for a lifetime license. After you order those, uh, you have to, uh, or you'll get an email giving you your login for the hotline and an email that will tell you how to download and register your data file component. So assuming you've done those and you've logged in to Day Trading Forecast uh, .com, you will get the uh, chart list of daytradingforecast.com. And on the right side of the page, there will be this line that says uh, Ninja Trader Moon Tide Data File, and it'll be for, for one month. It'll be updated monthly. Uh, and you simply click on that, and it'll give you, show you this data file, and do File Save As. And I've found a directory, if this is on my C drive, I've got a directory set up here for uh, Moon Tide Data. So I go in that directory and then click Save. And in this case, I've already done it, but uh, uh, if, if this were a new month, I would be wanting to overwrite this data and then I can close this. So at that point, I've taken the data file off of the day trading forecast server, placed it on my computer. Uh, just going to park these now. Okay, now that I've done that, I need to run my NinjaTrader program, and when I do that and get it set up, I will have uh, some charts. This is a chart for the mini uh, March contract, just a data chart. And under Indicators, I want to go in and I want to select my energy field trading data file component, bring it down here and uh, click on new. And that will give me the properties over here. File name, I want to go find that file I downloaded. So I click on the browse button and uh, I go find on my C drive my moon tide data and then I come in here and it'll be tide data dot text highlight that and open it and then I simply click 
OK. And NinjaTrader has now downloaded that data file. And I can display it either in a separate window or I can overlay it on price. Uh, by default, it displays in a separate window if you want to overlay it on price. You simply uh, go to your indicators panel, find the data file component, and in panel here, simply this is panel two. So your main chart's panel one, this is panel two. Uh, if you click on same as input series and click OK, It will display the chart, but it looks really screwy, doesn't it? Well, go back on indicators. That's because it's trying to display uh, the data file, which has a range uh, on the order of a few hundred, with the price scaling. So what we have to do here is scale justification here. On the data file, I picked the uh, same as input scale. Okay, where is it here? Data. Scale justification, pick left. And then apply that. And now I've got the two overlaid. So that's a quick uh, rundown on how you can plot your indicator, uh, the moon tide indicator versus the data file. You have the option to shift it left and right and by playing with the scale on the left side you can uh, size it any way you want. So that's how easy it is to uh, plot your moon tides on your own NinjaTrader chart.